Let's set up our elf on the shelf. I am gonna take off Elfie's dress because I don't want it to smell or get stained. Okay, so in this little jar, I put together a combination of cloves, ginger, and what else did I put in? I think it was nutmeg. So just go through your spice cabinet. I think the original I saw called for cumin and nutmeg. I didn't have any cumin, so work with what you have. Put it down in the jar. I covered mine with some toilet tissue and I've let it fester overnight. I didn't wanna leave my elf in there overnight because I don't want this smell to stick with it. sign in. Oh, I can smell it already. Close her back up and my daughter should be awake in about an hour and yeah, be ready. Um, Tim, you have your mother's hat on. Tim, can you get out of the jar? Um, I thought it opened <laughs> to smell. Ha oh, ha no. ha. Okay, I'll smell it. <laughs> it smells like peppermint. Ew. Okay. That must be torture for you on there. Take off the smell off of you. Well, we got elf farts. <laughs> That's cool. I, oh, he gave me a gift. It's first day of your advent. All right, let's see what is in here. There's a small card. Um, it's, it's green. It's a big one. Oh yes, green fluorite. Fluorite is a big word. Oh, it's pretty. Mm, it's not the one I wanted, but it, it is pretty. And we have 23 more days, right? That's a lot of days. It is a lot of days. It's cold. It's very cold. Really? Yeah. And a lot of people love it. Cute, 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 cute. Very cute. cute. Vlogmas day one has not gone as planned. Surprise, surprise. So I actually made these at work today um, with my homeschool kids, but I didn't get good video. It was just a really, really chaotic day. It was a good day, fun day, chaotic day. So I didn't get any good pictures, which is part of my job. So I'm gonna make my own at home. pictures of it. I kind of wanted to make one of these anyway. It's just a fun little home project. You take a branch or a stick, find something local. This is from my yard and I'm going to attach some twine, add some little ornaments, maybe some pine cones and yeah, it's going to be very, very fun. smaller little branches coming off because everything I'm hanging is very lightweight so it should be fine but it's gonna add <laughs> it's gonna add a little something I like little varying lengths it has a little more dimension and everything I'm hanging is very lightweight so it shouldn't be too much
that's going to be the hardest part is threading. Right now I'm going to sort through this yarn because I'll be doing another Christmas, well I'll be doing several Christmas projects this year, but one of them is a crochet project where I'm going to try to create, I'm going to at least get started on a Christmas tree made all of granny squares. I'm gonna try to recreate that tree and I'm getting started by going through a lot of my old yarn, specifically a lot of my Red Heart Super Saver because I don't really use it for anything. It's just been sitting in bins for a really long time and this is the perfect project to use it for. So I'm just gonna sort through a lot of my old yarn and pull out the Super Saver to make granny squares, one square a day, for 366 days because next year is actually a leap year but anyway today is December 1st so I want to get my first square done today so that by December 1st of next year I'm ready to assemble everything and make a beautiful Christmas tree of granny squares and we're gonna start on that we have we who's we me I have a lot of Christmas projects I have to do this year I organize a homeschool co-op and we do really fun art projects there. And I have a few other projects lined up at home. Today I'm not really articulating very well because I'm not feeling awesome, but I'm gonna organize this yarn, show you what day one of Vlogmas looked like for me in my very unesthetic, but pretty good life, pretty awesome life. And things are getting better. And the seasonal depression is gonna have to drag me <laughs> kicking and screaming this year. I'm I'm gonna do everything I can to keep myself balanced and join me for the next 24 days while I try to do that. <laughs> All right, let's get organized. These are my grandmother's knitting needles. I don't knit, <laughs> I crochet, but she gave them to me before she passed and I'm so, so happy that I have them. I actually do have a few of her crochet hooks, but they're pretty awesome and they have this super groovy case. And if I ever start knitting, but I really need to store them better than in the bottom up bin of yarn that I don't use. That doesn't make me feel good. But these make me very happy. And I will learn to knit and start using them. But until then, I'm just glad I have them with me. I am the only person in my family that does any kind of fiber arts so even though I don't knit I'm glad that I have these because I do crochet and I can learn to knit whereas some other people in my family I don't think anyone else in my family would have any interest in that because <laughs> so it's about a bunch of girls from a uh, town called Derry why does it call it dairy? Like, it sounds like a cow. It does kind of sound dairy like cow. a cow. <laughs> well, anyways, am I interrupting your video? Not at all. When did you even stop filming? I've been filming since 7 o'clock this morning. How long was that? When I first woke up this morning. I got it. I mean, like... So my first square is done it is seven inches across nine inches on the diagonal because right now my idea is to have the squares joined like this so 365 more to go so this will be the end of vlogmas 2023 day one what a hectic weird day but we had some fun right yeah see you tomorrow Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I hope you have fun this year. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I hope you have.